Hey guys, Robert Super Saiyan here, back again with another episode of Vainglory, Road to Vainglorious. <laughs> just, jo just joking, this is just a practice mode, I'm not really doing anything here uh, if, as far as gameplay. I kind of just wanted something for you guys to see while I talk about some uh, important things going on as far as my Vainglory content and what I'm putting out. Uh, as you could probably tell by the title, this is about this new application that I'm using to stream called Mob Crush. I don't know if you guys have heard about it at all, whether it's through Twitter or just by watching me, perhaps, I don't know. I don't have as many uh, followers as I do subscribers, so I'm sure a lot of you guys don't even know that I'm streaming on Mob Crush now. But essentially what it is, is it's a streaming service just for mobile games. So what is so important about that? So as far as Twitch, uh, the big thing is, is that the major scene on Twitch is PC and console gameplays. Uh, mobile does have some sort of sector there, but the viewership is very minuscule compared to their PC and uh, console counterparts. So what Mob Crush is doing is basically they want to fill that gap, that mobile gap for streaming uh, games on the fly and all that kind of stuff. Because uh, as a mobile gamer, I mean, you're always on the go. Uh, not necessarily do you always have access to a computer. Uh, so how are you going to stream on Twitch, you know? Uh, and that's where Mob, Catch, Mob Crush steps in. Uh, they basically uh, go from, if you have a jailbroken device, uh, do keep in mind this is just iOS for now. This is all in beta, so everything's still being tested. Uh, it's not fully released yet, so it's not in the App Store, but you can check the description down below for the link where you can download the application. You don't need to be jailbroken to view, like, streams. But you do need to be jailbroken if you want to stream on your device. Uh, you apply for the beta, and then from that point, once you jailbreak your device, you can stream directly from your device. Um, and another thing too is say, okay, I don't want to jailbreak because I, I feel like it's um, compromising my device and my information, my personal information getting out there and I'm really worried about it. All right, well, they do have another option. Um, right now they have this alpha testing going on with this Mob Crush app on MacBooks. So for instance, I have a MacBook and I can actually stream directly from my MacBook onto Mob Crush using that alpha version of the Mob Crush app. Uh, this allows you to have external devices such as a microphone and a face cam. <laughs> and uh, I mean, do keep in mind, if you are streaming from your device, you can in fact use uh, your front facing camera on your iPad or your phone. Um, but with Vanglore, it's kind of weird because you'll see your hand kind of cover it. Because basically, imagine the face cam is the screen or the front facing camera. And I'm playing with it. That's all, basically all you see, just like that. Basically, let's, let's, so the front facing camera is kind of wonky about that, uh, but it does give you the option. Uh, so if you're playing like Clash of Clans where your hand's not really in the way, um, it's an amazing thing. Um, it's, it's really innovative because when's the last time that you can stream pretty much any game you want on your mobile platform, uh, iOS for now, uh, without any computer? I know there are other companies out there that make games that have their own proprietary, like, uh, like built-in Twitch kit where you can actually stream directly from their game to Twitch, but it's just that game, just that game. Whereas with Mob Crush, you can stream any game you want on Mob Crush with very little uh, or demand on resources. So, for instance, this game plays at 60 frames per second. You guys may see that in my videos. I, I now upload it in 1080p, 60 frames per second. I can do Mob Crush and still maintain that 60 frames per second stream. Um, now keep in mind there is beta problems, like little bugs here and there, but it is beta. So I mean, you gotta figure that there's gonna be little things here and there. Uh, the one thing like I notice is like maybe uh, when I'm on my Mac app, the chat, sometimes some of the chat gets cut off. Little things like that, nothing too dramatic. Uh, they're really good about polishing the application and working out bugs. Uh, they're constantly releasing updates to help fix those bugs and squash those. Uh, but yeah, so how it works though is, for instance, you'll see me here. I'm playing Cruel doing nothing really because it's just practice mode. Uh, but say I want to stream. Say, say on the fly, I'm like, ooh, you know what? I'm already playing, but I want to stream. So let me go ahead and open this up. So you see a little tab there. You tap it, and there you go. That's literally all you got to do. 
Uh, once you're jailbroken and you have the Mac, or excuse me, you have the Mob Crush application on your device, this will be on your device. On any game you play, all you have to do is swipe from right to left on the right hand side of your iPad or your iPhone, whatever you're playing on, um, and this little dashboard comes up. You have the camera, so you can activate the front facing camera. Uh, you have the mic, the game. Um, the camera doesn't activate until you're actually streaming. So if you're wondering why the camera's not showing, it doesn't activate until you're streaming. Uh, but then you can change like the, the levels of the mic according to the game. So like if you increase the mic, the game sound lowers. If you increase the game sound, the mic lowers, that kind of thing. Uh, so you can set priorities there. Uh, and then you can also tweet to face or tweet and Facebook your uh, your stream, sharing that with the people that you want to, saying, hey, check me out on Mob Crush. Uh, it does it all for you. It's super easy. And all you got to do to start it is just hit start your broadcast. That's all it is. And then you're streaming. It's like so easy. And you you might be wondering why is this this giant like empty space in the center of this little banner here? That empty space is chat. So, for instance, if you're streaming on your device, like I said, you, some people don't have computers these, uh, nowadays. They have like an iPad, and like maybe like they're I don't know, 13, 14 years old. Their parents have a computer, but they're up late, staying up past their bedtime, and they're trying to stream. You know, they want to have that chat, and they don't have any other device to check chat. So that's why this is so wonderful. You have this little section here. My phone went off. Sorry. <laughs> that's why you have this little section right here. Where basically you just have, oh, let me silence my phone. Where you just have the chat show up, and every time the chat does show up, um, say for instance, it's closed. It's closed. When a chat pops up, all you're gonna see is this little bubble pop up, this little side uh, like that. It'll do that, saying, "Hey, there's a new uh, input in chat," and then you can go ahead and swipe and check it. Like, oh, okay, well, what did he say? Oh, he says I suck. Okay, <laughs> you know. That kind of thing. I mean, it's amazing. Like, it's so simplistic, too. Um, so, guys, I can't emphasize enough. This application is going crazy right now. They, they're they bringing in all these big mobile gaming YouTubers and streamers. They have B-Nates Gamer. They have Rage Elixir. They have, uh, what's this guy? What's that guy's name? Jack Frost Miner. Um, and then they have a bunch of others, like Jess and then the Green Skull. Well, there's just a lot of mobile gamers. You guys may not know some of them because it's not necessarily Vainglory. Uh, there's also like Minecraft streamers coming in, Minecraft YouTubers coming in, Modern Combat 5, that kind of stuff. Um, it's all those mobile games that are like in the spotlight are coming. All the streamers and YouTubers are coming to Mob Crush, and it's just amazing. And it's growing at a very extreme rate. Uh, if you check their Twitter, like they're getting like followers like left and right. I'm like, oh my god. Um, but yeah, so definitely check it out. Let me go ahead and just go to the actual application. So if you guys don't want to stream, you just want to check it out, you'll see what it entails. Uh, I'm going to go and kill this guy, though, because he's pissing me off. Bam! All right, let's go ahead and close this down. I was going to lose that match anyways. So there's Mob Crush. All right, so you can see there I'm featured. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's me. That's me. Uh, but yeah, so... Here's what the layout looks like when you first get in. You're going to have your profile on the top left. Uh, if you want to put a picture in, which I did, you can, uh, so that can represent yourself. Uh, you'll be in the first section called Watch. Basically, this is just all the live streams that are on right now. Uh, you have like some 29 Cater Gaming streaming Minecraft or GJ Squirtle streaming Vainglory with a black screen. Um, but yeah, so there's Rage Elixir, Beanie's Gamer. Big fan of Beanie's Gamer. And you can just go down more and more and more, and you'll see just a bunch of people stream. These are all the streams. Like, it's it's a long list. Like, it goes crazy. Um, like I said, it's still in beta, so, I mean, it's still limited to how many streamers can actually stream right now. But you can always apply, and if you're willing to jailbreak a device, you can definitely stream. Or if you have a MacBook, you can stream through that without jailbreaking a device. Now, there are other options coming in terms of how to stream. Uh, so, for instance, I know people don't want to jailbreak. Um, I don't, I'm not too sure about the specifics, but I know they're working on getting other forms of streaming out there, whether using a PC instead of a MacBook, or potentially streaming without the jailbreak. I don't know. Uh, but they did tell me that there's a lot of stuff in store, and they're super excited to get it out, but they want to make sure it's polished. Uh, but yeah, so this is basically what it looks like. You can go to broadcast. It basically tells you how to broadcast. Basically, well, I already told you because I'm awesome. 
Uh, but yeah, so then you have the features list. You can check it out. It's like I Chase, Hero, Brian Skull, uh, Paradigm, Venus Gamer, and so on and so forth. And then the amazing Rumbly Super Zed's on here. Holy crap, I'm going to check him out. There he is, 301 followers. <laughs> this guy's famous. All right, so uh, you can see there I have streamed 25 times. I'm on here quite a bit. Um, I stream at least five hours a week, at the very least. Uh, and, uh, you know, if you guys want to, I'm not trying to pressure you, but, I mean, you can hit these little buttons here. Uh, you know, share to Facebook, Twitter, you know. <laughs> you can. Uh, you don't have to, but, I mean, you can. Do it. <laughs> uh, all right, so then we have, like, Nexi PL, Jack Frost Miner. That guy is huge, man. That guy has, like, 400,000-plus subscribers on YouTube. So he's a big YouTuber, and he came to Mob Crush. So that's, like, that's a big statement. Like, if you have YouTubers of that caliber come to the platform to stream, that is amazing. Look at that, man. man he does better than me on Vanguard. <laughs> 1,934 views? Let's check out mine. Whatever. Whatever. I don't care. I don't care. I'm on the features list right there. Where are you? Oh, he's right below me. Damn it. <laughs> Look at that. Vainglory is on the top. Well, not the top, but it's visible as the games that are being featured. Uh, you have Minecraft, Modern Combat 5, and Vainglory are the big push apparently right now. Uh, you have Hearthstone as far as tournaments. Uh, but let's check out all the games. I mean, this is an abundance of games. If you want to play like um, Modern Combat 4, you have Blitz Brigade, you have Boom Beach, Clash of Clans is on here, all this stuff. So, I mean, it's so easy to find your games in here. It's amazing. Uh, definitely check it out. Again, to be specific, you don't need to have a jailbreak or a computer to view the streams. I mean, you can't really view the streams on the computer yet. I know they have a website coming out. Uh, but as of right now, they don't have the ability to watch the stream on the computer unless the streamer posts the link in Twitter or on their Facebook. Uh, that's the only way you can watch it on the computer. Uh, you just can't go to like a Mob Crush website and watch it on that site. You can only watch it through the links that are posted through the streamer on their Twitter or Facebook and so on and so forth. Um, but yeah, so I mean, just lost my train of thought, but... That is Mob Crush in a nutshell. Check it out. Basically, follow me is what I'm saying, because, you know, you just should. <laughs> follow me. Make me go from 301 to, like, 1,000, please. Uh, that'd be awesome. Um, but, yeah, I mean, if you guys are interested in this and you want to stream on Vanglory, because I know they're pushing for Vanglory, and the more streamers, the better. Sign up for that beta and start streaming your butt off, uh, because... You want to get your foot in the door when this thing takes off. Trust me. Uh, just like when Twitch started, those people who got their foot in the door in the beginning are now huge. And that's the big thing. It's like you want to get your foot in the door, get huge. They're bringing things, you know, like such as like Twitch where you have the donations. You have, uh, I don't know, I think they were talking about maybe potential overlays. Uh, you're going to have subscriptions in terms of like when you get big and you want to have uh, something to give back to the community you can through their subscriptions like to subscribe to you and you can give back through emotes and so on and so forth they're going to have very similar features to twitch uh, but i'm sure they're going to do their own little touch in terms of like the mob crush brand touch uh to kind of individualize the uh the application and separate themselves from twitch entirely uh, that way they're not just like doing a carbon copy uh but yeah i mean again check it out it's super easy it's super fun uh and it's still in beta, so do keep in mind there are going to be a few slight bugs. Nothing too dramatic, nothing like uh, that basically ruins your experience for the most part. Uh, it's pretty solid quality. We can even check. Let's see. This is watch my recent stream where I lost like so many matches in a row because I suck at POA. Uh, but let's go ahead and check it out. So here we go. I'm uh, killing that minion pretty good. Me, Nether. Oh, wait. Chat's up right there, too. I think you can close chat. There you go. Yeah. Look at that. That's amazing. That is amazing. That's all on my iPad. I did not use a computer at all for this. At all. Let's see what's going to go down here. Do it. And Roman Super Sets a Coward. 
Catherine going in for the ult. Rummy Super Set's still running. <laughs> Rummy Super Set's indecisive. Now they're going in. And the fight begins. Rummy Super Set's confused. <laughs> he's going for cruel. X Retsu. Oh, and then he's getting just demolished. <laughs> he's running again. <laughs> I did so bad this match, guys. Oh my goodness. Oh, he's gonna get Celeste. No, he's gonna run. He's gonna do what he does best and run. Damn it. <laughs> you suck, Rumbly. Uh, unfollow. But, uh, yeah, so that is Mob Crush, guys. I probably said this so many times, but I'm not really good at explaining things, so I try my best. Uh, but, yeah, so that is Mob Crush, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Definitely check it out. And if you want to, go ahead and follow me because, like I said, I stream five hours a week, a minimum. Uh, I am going to try to increase that. I I know people are talking about how I'm not doing Twitch right now. Um, and I'm kind of stepping down a little bit because not only because of scheduling, you know, being a problem because my wife went back to work. But also, I'm really enjoying Mob Crush, guys. I really am. And I will be doing Twitch again. Don't worry. Uh, but right now, like, I'm thinking Mob Crush is so simplistic, so easy for me, that it's just... Because I'm not, I'm not in there for the money, really, for Twitch. Like, like it's cool to get donations and stuff, but the main reason why I want to stream is so I can play with you guys. And I can do the exact same thing here on Mob Crush. And what's better is that you don't need to have the computer to watch. And, you, you know, you can just be on the application... Talk to me there. You can join the queue and play some games with me on Mob Crush. Uh, it's as easy as that. Uh, so definitely check it out, especially if you guys want to join in some uh, private matches, as I'll be doing private matches for the most part, uh, unless uh, I feel like doing Road to Bang Glorious. I've done that a couple times on here too. You can see here, um, let me see, I can actually pull out. So pub matches with Ben Tim 1. Actually, actually, that's actually when I hit Pinnacle of Awesome, I think. That was awesome. That was the pinnacle of awesome. So you can see here, I did a lot of the Road of Vainglorious. The SA Bronze, SA Silver, and then finally POA Bronze, and then Vainglorious, and then Beyond Vainglorious, uh, Vainglorious Diamond. <laughs> uh, got some cards. Cards are cool. Because I don't even need them. Or well, I do now, but before I didn't. But anyways, that is Mob Crush, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you guys next time. Later.